Hey guys, in this video I'm going to give you my top tips on how to raise the perfect bourbon. Make sure you stick it out till the end, because at the end I'm going to give you the most important one. So let's get into it. So you got yourself a new bourbon puppy. Let's make sure that the first thing that we do is we focus on the bond. Imagine you're a small puppy yourself and you've just left your mother, your siblings, so everything is new and you're all by yourself. What we need to do as new puppy owners, we need to make sure that that little puppy is going to be loved and it's going to feel safe and secure. Let's focus on that bond and you will end up with a puppy that's going to trust you wholeheartedly. The next tip is crate training. Dogs love dens and a crate can provide that space for them. It can be a place for your dog to rest after a long walk and also a place to put your dog when you need to go out to get some groceries. Rather than having the dog destroy your house, it will be safe and sound in its crate. Which comes to my next point. Teach your dogs to be on their own. It's okay for dogs to be by themselves. There is nothing worse for a dog to be anxious and barking the entire time that they are by themselves. So teach them that it's okay by training these steps slowly increasing the amount of time they are by themselves you will create a much more settled dog now on to the next one don't over exercise too early your puppy does most of its growing during the first 12 months of its life during this period we need to nurture the pup's bones and joints over exercising can result in a higher chance joint issues such as hip dysplasia. Adequate amount of free play time is enough exercise for these pups during the first 12 months. Things to play with your high energy puppy are tug of war or a good game of sniffing, so hiding kibble or other treats around in the room so that it needs to sniff and find these pieces of treats are good ways to get the energy out but still keep the stress of the joints. The next tip is to be the pack leader. Be the leader and create the boundaries. Dogs need structure and boundaries in order for them to be a good and well behaved bull. These dogs will test these boundaries and so you need to be strong and firm and you will have a great dog that will respect your leadership. And quickly, just before we get to the last point, please like and subscribe for more content like this video so that we can keep on growing the channel and spread how to raise puppies and dogs properly. Now for the last and most important point, socialization. Get your puppy used to as many different surroundings, sounds, animals, weather elements and people. It doesn't mean that they have to meet your puppy, it just means that your puppy needs to be aware and get used to all these different things just to get used to them so that they won't be anxious or scared or fearful. Thanks guys for listening, hope you enjoyed it and see you on the next video.